Hey there, fishing girl. So I did something really dumb a little bit ago. I deleted a bunch of GoPro videos from the SD card, including the intro to the video that uh, you're about to see. So what I did today is I went up and down the F uh, Flagler County beaches to see which beaches have been restored, which access points are open, which ones are still closed. I was actually surprised how many were still closed. So you'll see that in this video. So without any further ado, let's get into this video and check those beaches out. So as I'm driving here, I'm just gonna hold my phone up because I, I was gonna wait till I had my camera on, but I'm seeing, and we got somebody doing something with the wood here, but a lot of these, crossovers that I'm seeing south of Flagler Beach are actually crossed like they're they're completely closed off they're taking even wood planks and putting across the entryways that one's open yeah here's this Martin's restaurant that one is open okay this one is closed off it looks like yep beach closed so that one is too badly damaged yeah, most of these, I think I only saw one or two that was open south of Flagler Beach. We're coming down here to the water tower area. Look at that. That is definitely closed. <laughs> um, so we got uh, Snack Jacks. Looks like that is still maybe closed. We've got construction going on there. There's the Flagler Beach water tower. We're going to take a look out on this beach. Coming up here, this is still closed up. spot across from Gamble Rogers and this is just easier to take my phone and get good enough video with it for now for for this purpose just grabbing my phone if I go out to fish I will grab the GoPro if I decide to fish somewhere but you we, we were closed off here so um, I'm just trying to see if we can see down there Looks like it drops off there, so the, it looks like the end of that has been damaged. So, we'll not be getting a cart down here. I'm going to talk to you guys a little bit while I am driving, <laughs> keeping my eyes mostly on the road. But um, so, because I can't get you the, the exact locations for all these beach crossovers that we're passing. I believe there is a page on Flagler County Beaches website that has a listing of all of the crossovers and which ones are open, which ones are closed. They keep updating that as they open and close things. So I will try to find that again and put that down in the uh, description below so that you have that link. As I'm driving here, it looked like the two crossovers just before oh well to the to the south side of Oceanside Beach Bar and Grill those two look like they were open okay coming up to the pier just past one that was open this one's open where are we at this is 9th Street so south of 9th Street there's two of them open this one's open um, looks like these ones along the boardwalk might be open that one's open, that one's open. Coming up to this place where we used to get our cart down on the beach, this nice sandy ramp, and it is still gone. It is just a cliff. I mean, there's no getting down there at all. Plus it's taped off, so it's not allowed. The water looks beautiful. Got somebody swimming over there. There's that ramp down there, and that doesn't look like it's in good shape either, so I'm pretty sure that's still closed off. So for Flagler Beach, it's a no-go for a beach cart. But if you're coming down and just carrying poles down the staircase, then you got plenty of places where you can get down on the beach. But for a beach ramp, I don't think you're going to get it unless you're going to carry it down the stairs and you got people to help you. So keep that in mind. We're going to head north. Okay, so as we're driving, some of these accesses are open. Some of them are closed. That one's open. We're near breakaways. That's uh, south of breakaways is open. That one is open, just north of Breakaways. Um, let's see, we got another one coming up. That one's open. 
So yeah, a lot of these little walkovers with the stairs and stuff are open. Um, there was a few on the boardwalk north of the pier that were boarded off and somebody was climbing over one as we were passing by. Let's see, here's one here, there's cars here, so that one's open. We're across from these little condo areas. Let's see, it looks like that one is open. So yeah, a lot of these stair ones, the ones that have stairs, are open north of the pier. Still heading north. That one is broken. That one's closed off. Okay. Let's see what it says. That one's open. Across from a little cafe. That one's open. Here's these hotels here, whatever the condos. And uh, that one's open. That one is open. All right, we're over here at Beverly Beach. South is campground and great news, they have fixed this ramp. But look at that, it just looks beautiful. And it's fixed, yay. I, I thought it was gonna take them a long time to get this fixed, but it is good to go. We are here at Varn Park, and the good news is it looks like it is open, yay. This was closed a few weeks ago, so here we go. Okay, coming down here, oh wow. Yeah, this is, I don't think we want to bring a car down here. So we could maybe bring a pole or two. Check this out, I haven't been to Barn Park in a while. It actually looks pretty different to me. Unless I'm just used to being here at high tide. We got some people fishing here. So that was cool. I met some people who know me because of my videos and stuff. They called me my name before I even got there. And I almost got, well, I did get run over by this kite. <laughs> the guy who was flying it didn't see me. And <laughs> next thing I know, it's like in my face and wrapping around my body, the cords. So, but I didn't get hurt. And I thought it was funnier more than anything else. So. That was interesting. All right, here we are at Old Salt Park. Looks like they have made this, kind of put some new sand down, made this more accessible. Let's see what it looks like coming up over this little hill here. Can I get a cart down? And the answer is yes. It was a little sketchy before, but I would definitely get it down here. Here we are at Malacompra. Coming up the walkway here. Oh yeah, this is no problem. Got the rocks out there. We're here at Bay Drive Park and these walkovers look like they're open. So they have made a little ramp there to get stuff out on the beach and they are adding back a bunch of sand. This, through this whole area here. Looks like just up to that little thing. They're beginning the restoration process here. They closed off the ramp because it broke off. Gotcha. All right, well now we know. We still can't bring a beach cart down here. I just passed Washington Oak State Park and that is still blocked off. They've got it completely closed. They've got orange little uh, construction cones across the front so you can't even turn in there. So just in case you're wondering, Washington Oak State Park is not gonna work for the beach. Last stop, I know Matanzas Beach is open so I don't need to go there. Um, but this is Greenland. <laughs> All the rocks, wow. I don't remember there being this many rocks before. But, um, yeah, but the, um, there's a little walkway where I used to be able to get my cart out, and that is blocked. They don't have that open. 